you know, um, we'll see how it pans out. But it's a massive game, like you say, for York City today. I know people were saying about Southend winning at Yeovil, but really, for me, York have just got to win these home games. You know, this this one. You so know, York City currently 18th. Barnett, I remind you, fifth look, looking to challenge for third. We have an Ellis Long throw towards the goalkeeper. We've had to hold on to that one amongst the sea of players. At York, we can relate to FA Trophy semi-final defeat. Here's Winter playing a central ball, and there's a little bit of space edge of the D. Quick turn and shot is just a simple one from Senior. Beats his man for pace, fizzed it across the area, across the back, looking for John Lewis. Oh, done well there. Fantastically done by Alex Hurst. He's going to tease, he's going to cross, and John oh. Lewis, oh, how did he miss? Oh. Strange, wasn't it? Han Hancock's, it was obviously a training ground thing. Hancock's gave it the slightest of touches underneath his boots. Take two. Duckworth again's going to hit it. Over and rising and poor. South stand, by the way, is looking massive. Here comes the Hancock's cross towards the far post. Ellis goes up with the header. He's always the one to get the height on it, but there was too much height on the resulting header as well. Free kick centre of the park for Barnett. So a lot of players up here, taken by Collinge. He's looking for the head of Winter. Heads it towards Kabamba. Well claimed, Whitley. Gets it onto his right. Here comes the cross. Ellis is looking for it. He does yeah. jump. He gets it onto John Lewis. Oh. Palmed over by the goalie. Yeah, really good play there. Head tennis on the far side. Always onside, is he? We're waiting. No flags. Ford. Ford coming in to the area. Ford. One on one now. Jack Ford he scores. On the pitch is where it matters right now. On the pitch is where City are one nil up. Yeah. Another right-footed ball in far side towards Beard. Diar is out there as well. Donellis just intervening. Can't get it fully clear. It's another scramble on the left-hand side. Fantastic. Great. Difficult one to defend. It comes goalwards. Deflects out of Hancock, I think, and a good, yeah, really good block there. Put by Whittle. It. Long ball through the centre. Is he going to get there first before the goal? Yes. He does. He's got around him. Hancock oh. can't chase it down. Um, Collinge for Barnett, playing more defensively this half and trying to pick out Beard with the diagonal. Beard's first chest down is excellent. Gets onto his left, tries to cross it. Oh. Whitney can't hold it, and it spins out. Nice John Lewis. Oh, the pod is onside, definitely. Ford, similar thing to the first one. Can he get a second? Ford, oh dear. Oh, I wonder whether that just bobbled up. He would, be, he would be my player of the season. If I had to pick one, then John Lewis. Free kick for York. Duckworth, right footed cross. Ellis, header, oh! just wide. Wow, what a chance. Oh, I think he's onside here, John Lewis. Indeed. John Lewis is going to better if he could just it down. He has managed to keep possession, though. Well, I may even see a shot from distance from Dyson. Oh, he hit it goalward. Goalkeeper. Great position. Great, great position. Very central. Five yards outside of the D. This Hancock's is the only man on it. Hancock's way off target. Yeah, it's woeful, isn't it? Mark Moyo for this Barnet throw down the line. Competes with it well over to John Lewis. Though. John Lewis is going to bear down on the goalkeeper. John Lewis. Oh, went for glory. Off target again. Barnet have just not threatened, and you've got to say they must be close to the end of the six minutes of added time because I mean, Barnet seems to have taken. And there is the full time whistle. And 